Yo, what is up guys? Blackburger here again with another, yeah, that's right, week two of Bargain Player of the Week. Or I should just call it Best Player for the Value? This week's Player of the Week is going to be Josh Gordon. That's right, the Cleveland Brown. And no, I'm not ashamed of it. This guy's a great player. He has entry-level elite speed with 90, 89 agility, 89 acceleration, 72 carrying, which basically means I can trust him running the ball. He has mediocre catching stats, but the big number here is 84 release, which means he can get off the line of scrimmage like an absolute boss. The guy's a great end zone fade kind of guy. I worked three of them with him, and they were great. Out of the 32 balls I threw him, he only dropped one, which makes him great. The guy's an absolute monster, especially for the value. I bought him for a measly 500 coins, makes him an absolute beast. Although he doesn't run the Christmas routes, he does end up wide open, and definitely, yes, he can take it down the field and score touchdowns, as you can see here. This is one of my favorite players to play with, especially if I'm only on a thousand dollar budget, a thousand coin budget. The next player of the week is going to be Mr. Kenny Vaccaro, strong safety for the New Orleans Saints, rookie. Although he is slow with 81 speed, he has great ball playing skills. He doesn't have the best hands, but he plays the ball, plays the run very well. 62 catching means he can eh, catch the ball once in a while, but the dude's an absolute beast in ball hawk and he has a nose for the run. The big stat that sticks out here is 81 man coverage and 78 zone coverage. That means he can cover the ball pretty well. He has great pursuit, great play recognition, and great hit power with 82. The guy's an absolute tank. He was making great tackles behind the line of scrimmage, outside of the sideline, in the middle of the field, everywhere. This guy was everywhere making tackles. He is so good that he actually has... He actually has a spot on my roster right now. He's currently my starting strong safety, although I have some better players like Troy Palomalu. Troy Palomalu wasn't producing, Kenny Vicar was killing people like Alex Smith. Which makes anyone happy, because when you can kill a quarterback, eh, you got a good chance to win. I bought Kenny Vicar for another 500 coins, but I will rank him up with a 5,000, 6,000 coin value. If you need a starting strong safety, definitely check out Kenny Vicar. Let me know if you guys like him, because I love him. No homo. Some honorable mentions include Demarius Davis, he is a New York Jet inside linebacker. Yeah, yeah I know, yeah, I know, I know, it's the Jets, they, they kind of suck. But the guy's good. He's 85 speed, 90 acceleration, which means he's actually faster than Kenny Vaccaro and he can bang. He has 82 hit power. If you're a kind of guy that likes to use their inside linebackers, this guy's the guy to use because he's so fast. Although he doesn't have the highest strength, he has mediocre 81 strength, which makes him strong, but not Patrick Willis strong. He can still bang, he can still run, he can still catch. Another honorable mention is the Reggie Wayne. Yes, the perennial pro bowler. The guy that's going to end up in the Hall of Fame. The guy that plays with Peyton Manning, or played with Peyton Manning, now plays with Andrew Luck. He is an absolute tank. I love having Reggie Wayne on my team. And not even the gold one. I guess they didn't have an elite one for some reason. But not the gold one, the top 100 one. The guy catches everything going his way. Although he's slow, he has the best hands. For a third and goal, or third and short or third and long even as long as he's there he's gonna catch the ball thank you guys for watching that's another video uh tune in next week and yes the cards are gonna get better eventually tune in next week for another video hasta luego